Hello, and welcome to the latest video of Exploring Modular Synths. Um, recently, I've been experimenting with using different things as oscillators. And one of the great things about modular is that practically anything can be used as a sound source or as an oscillator. So, I recently discovered that the Make Noise Equiphone, which is a delay, can actually be used as an oscillator and you can even play things with it uh, through the pitch input um, of it as an oscillator. So what we're going to do is uh, just explore that um, and uh, we're going to start by feeding something into the Echophone and we're going to use this new module that I got which is the Cyclonic Shapeshifter which is a digital oscillator uh, it's great, really interesting sounds. One of the sounds that it has is uh, it has different vocal sounds that sound like voices. So we're going to hear that. And what I'm doing is um, I'm feeding in a sequence from the Rene here via the CV out. And the Rene is playing a sequence. It's being clocked by Pamela's workout. And that sequence is going into the pitch input of the shapeshifter. Uh, its FM and its wave shape is being modulated by two low frequency oscillators from the Batumi, just to give it some interest. And it's got two outputs. One is the vocal output, and the other is just a regular output so that you can kind of hear what the actual line is. So the line that's being fed into it right now actually sounds like this. <laughs> But what it sounds like when the um, when the vocal uh, sound is being used is this. It's actually the same input uh, coming in via CV from the Rene. Together, they sound like this. But we're actually just going to use that kind of weird voice thing. That is um, going into the echophone input, and then the echophone output is just going uh, going into my output. That's what you're hearing. So what we're going to do is um, is we're going to turn up the echo the echo time on the echophone all the way, and we're going to input some sound into it. And we're going to use the freeze button to freeze. Uh, a bit of that input uh, into the echophone, into the buffer. And then what we're going to do is gradually change the echo time and the pitch to get an audio rate. And what we're going to do after we get that audio rate is we're going to take the CV that was coming out of the Rene to sequence the shapeshifter oscillator and use it to sequence the echophone basically turning the echophone into an oscillator. So, pretty simple idea, but um, it's a neat discovery for me, and it sounds like this. So here's, here's the, um, here's the shapeshifter. So we freeze that. That's what it sounds like. Let's capture a little bit more of that. Then we're going to turn off the input from the echophone. Okay. So now we just have the repeated buffer in the echophone. And we have it completely wet, so no new inputs coming into it. So we're just going to use this.
and now patch the Rene sequencer into the pitch input of the Ecophone. Now the Echophone actually has two pitch inputs, in, so we can actually put pressure points, which is running a slow sequence of different CVs into the second one and hear what that sounds like. So what's that th what that's doing is it's actually transposing the sequence up as it moves through pressure points with the additional CV coming in here. So that's just um, using the ectophone as an oscillator. Thanks for watching.